Sur Palermo, Costa Rica, 6032. This is the 911 call made from the Argentine Hotel, where British singer and former One Direction member Liam Payne was found dead. A hotel employee tells the operator that there's a guest intoxicated by drugs and alcohol. They say he's breaking the whole room. And that they are afraid he might do something that will put his life at risk. It was later that evening that police say Payne fell from the third floor balcony of his hotel room. An Argentine prosecutor's office revealed his autopsy a day later on Thursday. It said he died due to multiple traumas and internal and external bleeding caused by a fall. In a statement, police said Payne's hotel room was in, quote, total disorder, with various broken objects and medications scattered. At an overnight vigil outside of the hotel, Romina Petrone shared a video of her daughter meeting Payne just two weeks prior. She said to me, Mom, I'm going to the hotel. I'm going to meet him. And well, she did it. Today, when I found out, I called her at work, and she couldn't believe it. She said, you're lying. The 31-year-old singer rose to fame with One Direction, one of the world's biggest selling boy bands. They got their start on Britain's X Factor in 2010. They broke up in 2016 to pursue solo careers. Details surrounding his death remained unclear, though Payne had spoken publicly about his struggles with mental health and using alcohol to cope with the pressures of fame. Residents from Payne's hometown of Wolverhampton say it's a sad day for the community. He's a dad, he's a, he's a son, he's a brother, and he means a lot to people, and especially our community as well, and it's just really sad as, just to hear about it. He leaves behind his son Bear, who he had with British TV personality Cheryl.